This is peace bad, this is peace bad, all day long, all day long. She gon' get a big bite, she gon' get a big bite sooner or later, sooner or later. Hey y'all, I just want to come out here, because I don't know who is this coming in my comment, talking about, they supposed to be Pete, the meat cousin. And try and say that Auntie Baby Boogie Woogie don't know what she talking about. Okay, well, you know, well, what's his mama name then? Okay. Because, see, the thing you feel, cousins what? Cousins come for everywhere when you think people famous and got some money. See, I know what the hell I'm talking about. And everybody know Miss Carolyn. Miss Carolyn lived in Beachwood Apartments on 22nd Cross Fletcher, upstairs, her and Dwight, her husband, Pete the Meat Mother. I knew Pete before I knew that any of my friends had children from him. Because he would stay with them, but he always stayed with his grandma. And Pete's mother, Miss Carolyn, was my neighbor for a minute. If y'all remember Miss Carolyn, anybody from Tampa, Florida, know Pete Meat. Mother name is Carolyn, and her husband was named Dwight. I don't know if Dwight's still living, but Miss Carolyn passed when I was living there. Miss Carolyn used to wait for me when I used to come home from the bar. I know Pete and them very well. Miss, I know his mother very well. I used to go buy breakfast on 22nd and late. From the restaurant when not was working there, when not went to Fed prison. So don't tell me about what I don't know, honey. Maybe it's the one that you don't know. I know her uncle not. I know all of them. Know her grandma. Know her granny is her great grandma. Miss Carolyn is her grandmother. So who is these cousins coming trying to come in the picture? I don't know, y'all. But I know what the hell I'm talking about. And two of my friends do have babies from Pete because my girlfriend, she was shocked that I knew Miss Carolyn. She was shocked that me and Miss Carolyn was neighbors. I said me and Miss Carolyn was all right. We was pretty close. And her husband, Dwight. All of us. Because we all was in the game together. <laughs> Boy, Auntie, I have to come out here and just tell these people. Please leave me the hell alone. Ain't nobody trying to get shit for content. And I'm very concerned and very sincere about my friend Pete the Meat, okay? I'm not like all y'all other bullshitters. And I know, just like I say, his children do care about him. They sure do. You need to go talk to your goddamn, um, is she supposed to be some king to you. You need to go talk to Peach Mike and so maybe she don't know the history of her family. But Auntie Baby Boogie Boogie do. Mm -hmm. This girl was one of the best neighbors I had when I moved to Tampa back there in the day. On 22nd and Fletcher, 21st Street. Me and her lived there for 21st Street. If anybody knows Miss Carolyn Peep mother, they know she lived there. Had a beautiful apartment upstairs. Beachwood Apartments, right there. She lived it over me. And I lived it to the bottom. And we lost Miss Carolyn with a massacre heart attack, but Granny lived a long time. Mm hmm. Not had went to fair prison, but he came out and he made sure Granny was straight. So don't tell me about what the F I don't know, okay? Sometimes y'all just need to mind your business. Bye. Don't get nothing on you, y'all. But you know, Auntie Baby Boogie Boogie have to let them know who she know. I don't have to fake no funk with nobody, baby, because I know. That was my girl. She helped me every night when I came home from the bar drunk. Help mine get out the car. All right, I love y'all. Bye.